So, you want to know the secret for faster lap times? Well, you might be using 2 to 5 tenth with badly optimized graphic settings. And there's one secret setting in particular that you have to optimize to get faster lap times. Which setting is that you ask? Let's get straight to it. So, uh, coming to graphic settings, the first thing is gamma adjustment. Uh, all this does is you know increase or decrease your screen brightness. Uh, the default is set at 100, but I like it at 95 because you know I like the darks to pop up more. Uh, so adjust this to whatever you prefer. Coming to motion blur, always keep motion blur to zero. Do not increase the motion blur. This might have an impact on your FPS also. Staring on animation on off doesn't really matter. Now coming to video mode. Uh, display adapter make sure that the dedicated GPU is selected and not your CPU. Uh, resolu uh, resolution uh, make sure that the screen resolution matches your display resolution. Mm, so mine is uh, so my screen resolution is at 1080p because you know my display maxim maxes out at 1080p. So if if your display goes all the way up to 1440p, set this all set this to 1440p. Display mode full screen and aspect ratio 16 is to 9. Uh, keep the VSync off. Do not keep this. Uh, do not turn this on. VSync in, v -sync interval auto. Coming to refresh rate, you have two options either auto, you can keep this at auto, or you can match this to, to your, your screen resolution. Whichever you prefer, keep this on. Remember the secret settings that I was talking about? Well, this is it frame rate limiter make sure that you turn this on as default it will be is it will be turned off but you have to turn this on and you have to set a maximum fps of 60 to 70 okay so what this does is this will limit your maximum fps to 60 and because your fps is capped at 60 it will help you go faster uh, we are doing this simply because this is this is the fastest way around uh, this is the meta uh, this settings is used by esports drivers so well you know they can't be wrong uh, you can turn this off you can turn these settings off and when you turn this off you will get around 400 to 500 fps but that just makes you go slow uh, you will lose around two to four tenths per lap if you turn this off uh, so this is all about speed so if you don't care about speed you can turn this off but you know, remember this will help you go faster uh, so for the next one keep this at 16x uh, this has been the meta from for the past uh, three four year uh, keep it at 16x it looks way better uh, next, uh, you have two options between NVIDIA DLSS and uh, AMD FSR2. So whichever graphics card you have, set this to that. Uh, I have uh, the uh, NVIDIA graphic card, so I'll keep it at DLSS. Uh, and for this, keep it at balanced or quality. Uh, keep it at quality. Uh, see if there is any jitters or lags. So if, if you are facing any jitters or lag, keep it at balance. Uh, but mostly it, it should run on quality uh, so that's all about the video mode don't change anything so uh, coming to ray tracing uh, keep this at high or medium uh, so this really depends on your gpu performance you know so if, if you are running on a lower gpu keep this at low or if you are uh, if you're running on a higher gpu keep this at medium or high so remember as you increase the ray tracing your fps will decrease so that's the important thing as you increase the ray tracing to medium or high or ultra high your fps will decrease but it's not really a problem for us because we are capping our fps to 60 so it so it should be good that you run the uh, ray tracing at medium so the basically the, the base thing is you have to set this according to your gpu performance uh, i prefer to run this on medium you know because i feel that it's a good balance between the fps and the looks of the game uh, so you can set this to low and you will get a, a higher fps like all the way around 500 mm, you know if, if you remove the fps cap of course but you know for to get a faster lap time set this to medium so the thing about ray tracing quality is that there's only two options it's either high or medium uh, unfortunately there's no off or low option here so uh, keep it at medium always keep it at medium before because i have seen that if you keep it at high the frame rate drops like crazy 
if you keep this at high and you feel like you still have some you know, lag or jitters make sure that you turn ray tracing shadow off ray tracing reflections off ray tracing ambience occlusion off and ray traced transparent reflection off and ray traced ddgi off so make sure you set all these settings to off and not on so yeah this is all about ray tracing remember the higher the ray tracing you keep the lower the fps you get so at the end just do a benchmark test you know just to see how much uh, fps you are actually getting so here's the result of my score uh, so i ran with the resolution of 1080p and my uh, ray tracing was set to medium uh, so with that i got an, an average fps of 68 uh, with the minimum FPS of 65 and maximum FPS of 69 so remember I did cap my FPS to 70 uh, that's the reason I'm getting FPS just below 70 so yeah that's all the graphic settings that you have to optimize to get a faster lap time I'm pretty sure that you will save around 2 to 5 10 per lap uh, I hope this video was helpful thanks for watching